Welcome back everybody to the useless Mr. Moon show, a horror show and today we're gonna play a little bit of a different game than we do usually. It looked very eerie, it looked very creepy, but it's different than we usually play here. Ladies and gentlemen, this game is called Telefor Teleforum, Teleforium, Teleforum, and I think it's kind of a click, point and click horror game, but it looked on pictures fantastic it looked really creepy it looked really eerie so ladies and gentlemen we're gonna hop in we're not gonna waste any more time if you're new to the channel leave a subscribe and like of course but for now i hope this is going to be scary and we're gonna hop in ladies and gentlemen here we go all right teleform it's called teleform julian okay this is this is the right building Do we proceed? Is there a way to proceed? Hey, you got the camera on. Let me remove the lens cover on. Now? Let me remove the lens cover. Oh boy. There. Mr. Cameraman. Cameraman. <laughs> okay. Juliana says, right, it's the best to have as much material as possible. We want the sixth floor. Can you get the can you get the button? That's cool. See? Different than usual. Different than these Hockey Simulator psychological horror games we play on the channel. What is this? You look like you have something to say. Yeah, tell me then. Don't you... Oh, we're playing as the camera, man. I, I, I can see. Don't you think it's wrong to bother a widow? I was just thinking about what happened. Did you get authorization? I don't give a shit about that. If you don't do this, someone else will. You know Augusto. Back at the station, he's itching to make a special show about this. Okay, so we need to be quicker than him, though. I'm gonna make some success. Trust me, new guy, I didn't get here waiting for them to give me the jobs. Yeah, she's right, it was bizarre. You didn't see it, did you? They just told me how it happened, but he used to, you know? Lucky. I wish I hadn't seen it. Seen what? I wanna know! We don't know yet. We haven't seen anything in the beginning. Put a little bit louder. You heard it, right? He gave Kelso a VHS tape. The operator? Right. Kelso, Celso was supposed to broadcast the tape, but he couldn't. Technical issues. Then BAM! It happened. Oh, we are here. Come on. Oh, it, looks, it looks creepy, man. Look, this looks creepy. Okay. We're going to the apartment 608. Easy to remember. Go to the light side, head towards the trash bags. Wait, wait, wait. Um, he might need a little bit. Be six, six, four. I don't know where it goes, so we go to trash bags. Six, eight. So we did. We made the right choice. Thinking that it's that apartment just ahead. Here we are. Well, let's get ready, shall we? You can film her getting the door and all that. So you should knock on the door, ring the bell. What I look better on video? What will look better on the video? Uh, okay. Open up, FBI! I wonder if she's up to talk to strangers right now. I hope the camera doesn't act up during the interview. You know what? We'll go with the first one. If she isn't, she will be now. <laughs> yeah, of course. Let me try again. Fuck's sake, we're annoying her already. She's gonna kill us. Is she even home? Bear called her right after it happened. I doubt she left the house since yesterday. Oh, that's ominous, man. Alright, third time's the charm. Adriana. What do you want from me? Hi, Mrs. Martins. We're from Channel 8. We came to give you our condolences. Do you really need to feed a camera for that? We're making a special program about Walter. A homage. Homage. A kind of retros retrospective, you see. He worked at the station for so long. So we want to talk to you about him, about what happened. 
right. I ain't coming. I might be good talk. To, might be good to talk about it. Okay, she's quite open for it. Quick thinker, homage. <laughs> yeah, that's that's how I would homage. <laughs> how I would react. Yeah, why not? We can edit it later. Right now, we need to raw material. Come on. Before she changes her mind. I think it's a really story-driven horror game. It's like very eerie. Oh, yeah. Thank you again for welcoming us in, Mrs. Martins. Mm. Silva here. Uh, Silva here will film our conversation if that's okay. Do we now? I have to think about that. What? Would you like to drink anything? Tea? Coffee? Poisoned? Substance? Oh, I never refuse a cup of coffee. I'll go make some. I don't know why I gave that face to that woman, but we're going with it. She put that fast one. She put a fast one on you, huh? Forget that. Let's snoop around while we have the chance. Make sure to get every anything that catches your eye on camera. We are surrounded by material here. Look at these certificates. Journalism degree from UFRGS. Specialization in communication. Walter was well educated. I think Miss Martis is just the same. What a waste. Oh, it would be a shame if you only had shots of the same wall. So look around the whole room here, okay? Oh, we can... Oh, TV. Hey, that TV shoot looks good. Something funny about this TV? I think there was lightning strike nearby the other day. Might have messed it up. Actually, I'm pretty sure if it happened the same day that Walter, you know? What happened to Walter? I think that's his chair. Look at this photo. Some scenery, huh? Not a very appealing scenery. Plus, it's out of focus. This photo has a story behind it. I can feel it. I might ask her about it during the interview. I'm a big asshole. There's a painting here. I think Miss March painted this. I can hear her putting wa water in the filter. We need to hurry up. We back to check out all you can now. Plants begging for water, I guess. It, I don't. That's not really important information, I guess. Look at this headline The tragic passing of Walter Martins. Let me actually see a little bit more frame. <laughs> I'm getting too cozy here. So it's made the news already. I'm surprised he actually kept the paper. The mo they move fast to cover this one. They move fast to cover this one. It happened live. Of course, it was shocking. What happened? Oh no, look, a daily, a daily trophy. Oh right, Walter got one for the article he wrote back in the 70s. Stage owner thought this would make us stand out more, but it didn't happen. Local stage have zero chance against the big ones. I think they even had a lobby going on to hush this up. More stuff that we can click on? No, right? Is it gonna rain today? Partly. Roos says otherwise, look. Ah, oh, these roos never get it right. Hmm, guess we can use this take to set the mood. Coffee is almost done. Hey, woman. Do you have one? Uh, no, I'm fine. Feel free to have one if you change your mind. Thank you. I'm not gonna drink from a creepy stranger. Heh, <laughs> no. So did you think it over? That's how people die in horror movies, right? I did. Let's get this done with. Great. We begin short. Let's shoot the interview on that chair, Silva. Okay, let's have the conversation. Ready? No, but it doesn't matter. Okay, let's go in three, two, action. We're here with Miss March, Agent March, wife of Walter March, our dear colleague who left us so abruptly. She agreed to give us an interview during these most trying of times. House itself really tells a story about how you two lived. Uh, blurred photo on the shelf. You have a rather peculiar picture in your living room. Uh, well, next to you. She's looking creepy though. Ah, that was the first picture I took with the two of us. 
put the camera on the tripod and set it all up to take our picture. But then, well, this lap wing, the lap wing showed up out of nowhere. I think we were too close to its nest. The bird got furious and attacked the camera right when it took the picture. Then it attacked us. That was the result. A portrait. Neither of us appear in. From yours truly, the great photographer. He found it so funny, we had it framed. That's actually pretty, pretty good humor though. I used to find it funny too. About the paper headlines, let's go. The event has been garnering, garnering, garnering some media attention. Gathering maybe? Did this have an impact on you? I haven't slept in a while. Oh, yeah. In the morning when I get that newspaper, there it was, the headline, staring at me, chasing me. Then I locked myself in here. You two arrived. So yes, I'd say it's having quite the impact on me. The award interview. Okay. Walt well, was a very high caliber professional working at a small station. Would you like to comment on that? He felt he had less problems with higher ups when working at a smaller station. He could suggest topics, be more hands on. He also believed in keeping local stations alive. We lived well. He was an ambitious man. Not in that sense. He was a good man. Difficult in degrees. You two are quite well educated, aren't you? You can say so. I studied quite a bit. History, theater. Theater? I met Walter at an elo eloquence, eloquence workshop. I don't know what that means. I used to help him out. Can you believe he had a speech impediment? Bad diction. Nobody noticed it today. His articulated speech. That was my gift. Well, nobody's notes gonna notice today because he's dead. Sorry, I didn't think I can keep going. Of course, Miss Mark, we have enough material already. He was so different, so nervous. I never expected him to. Do what? What did he do? No one expected, Mrs. Martin. I still can't even imagine Walt handling a gun. What did he do? Gun? What gun? Walter never had a gun. He... The gun. The one he used during the show's broadcast. He did not use a gun. I know it was horrible, but I saw it when, it, when he pulled the trigger. Did he commit suicide on TV? No. After watching the tape, right? That's what Ferreira told you back at the station, right? I was told he took poison. I have no clue. I'm going with... Use the knife. What? How can that be? My god. I knew it. Ever since he got that damn bloody tape. The tape he tried to broadcast? He also examined the tape back at the studio. I think the film was burned. Something like that. Oh, damn it. That wasn't the tape. Not the original one. There was a copy. Seriously? I think it's kind of uh, like the ring. We still have the original one. Yes, here. Ha! <laughs> she feeds with the tape like this. I don't know what he saw in this thing. And I don't know where he got it from. Walter made me swear to never watch it. He only watched it when I wasn't, wasn't at home. Or in the small hours of the morning. You want to watch it, don't you? For your show. I don't think that's a good idea. But I'm too tired to try to change your mind. I, I'm going outside to have a smoke. I didn't even want to hear this thing. Well, she let it happen in her house? This is it. We have quite the story here. You look like you've seen a ghost. You'll stay, right? No. I gotta see as well. It's a stupid mistake, I know. I know, I know. It's a stupid mistake, but I'm also curious if it's just a game. In real life, I would be... Really, I would be out. It will take a week to... Get it off my mind, like to say, What was on that tape? It will take a, a week or about something like that. I knew I made the right decision in bringing you with me. Okay, this is how we do it. You film me as as I watch the thing. We have more ta takes that way. We can insert the tapes content in the video during editing. That's not gonna work. You're gonna die. We're both gonna die. Right, let's make some room here. Can you move to the left? Alright, let's begin. 
let's get my first impression of film. I can fix it all in the editing later. Yeah, that's how it works. <laughs> there, I'll press play. It's starting. Hey, let me see. What is this place? I don't recognize this building. The symbols. I can almost. Can almost what? Do they mean anything to you? I don't see anything. Your big fat head is in front of it. Yes, looking at them makes my head hurt. Gives me a deja vu. I feel like I can almost understand them. I'm going with this one. But at the same time, I can't. It feels like they get entangled inside your brain. Okay. Oh, he changed. Good. So he did go inside the building. What is this place? Looks like a prison. Like a shopping mall. Looks like a museum. Looks like a school. Honestly, it looks like a prison. Prison. Inside the cells. Are those... Are those people? He just walked by everything. Why is this so freaking ominous? It's so eerie. What sort of building is this? It's way too long. Look. There's someone... Up ahead. That guy, he looks... He looks... Turn up the volume. Oh, there we go. Take my hand, we'll take a walk. We go and hop into Mr. Moose's fort. Get to zero inside the last arc, I will buy you in the sky. Sounds like it mentions someone named Oscar. Set KA, we are assuming control. going with this one. Who's charred? You really heard that? I can't understand the damn thing. Let me turn up the volume and one more time. This is creepy. This is absolutely creepy. Dot 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 He said something to us. We're gonna do something horrible now. Are you okay? That's it, I'm turning this thing off. Hey, you okay? I felt something too. I almost got possessed here. Ah, the lightning. Happened uh, the yesterday as well in the game. Community TV. At 8 a.m. 8 past 8 p.m. it's sign 8. 10 past 10 is programmer. And at 12 a.m. zero reporter. Now on community TV. Ready? Okay. We're in the right. Oh, we're going there. Wait, is her face also changed? On the picture? Is the camera on? Let me. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, it looks like you have seen a ghost. Yeah, I'm, I'm reacting like this. Different, right? It's just some deja vu, yeah. 
Right. I think it's part of the game still. I think we're not replaying the complete game. I think there's going to be new options here. We could we, we didn't have to put on the uh, switch click on the switch um the six button. It's going to be different for sure. Are we going to follow the whole Let's go to 608 already. I'm curious. Had to watch the window. Here towards the window. What are you doing? Can we jump? Can you do that? Ah. Okay. We said we're gonna shoot some footage for the video. Each other, right? Come on, let's go. It's different. It's so different. There's the apartment. Finally. I'll do the talking. Three times, right? This was... Evening. We're from Channel 8. We came to talk to you about the, what happened. You don't mind if we record this, right? She's also more pushy now. I... You want to talk about Walter, right? The recent events? Everything's stuck in your throat, isn't it? Whoa, she's aggressive. Juliana. Come in, it might be good to speak to someone. Yeah, hey, aren't you coming on a little... There's something off here. Yeah, I want to say that as well, but I can't choose. Aren't you coming on a little too strong? Yeah, she's really for it this time. We're going with this one. No, we need to investigate this. No, I think her picture changed as well. She got a whole life to mourn. Whoa. He just turned out into a bitch. I'm curious. We're about to begin. We have anything? Tea? Coffee? She's probably gonna say no this time. No, thanks. See? Well, I'm going to make something anyway. Hey, Doogie! Oh, let's just go. What is wrong with her? We have to wait for her. I'll I'll have a look around here. Yeah, what? Whatever. Why is she so aggressive? Hey, gunpowder. He seems a little nervous, uneasy, or is he afraid? Look at all these certificates. Walter wasn't a complex dumbass, unlike some people back at the studio. Right. She's way more aggressive this time. She's not nice. The different universe. But I don't recognize any of these institutions. So many books. Hmm. Huh. There's one missing. Wait. Plans? Still? What kind of plan is this? No idea, man. It will take care of, it's well taken care of. I think Miss Smart didn't let the tragedy affect her routine. Wait, this plant was before uh, kind of dead, right? Maybe it was keeping her in functional right now. Hey, there's a weird thing hanging above the front door. Look, go there and take it off. What? You heard me, you can reach up there if you jump, right? Take it down, it's getting on my nerves. I won't do that. Oh, fuck that. You always talk back like that. Are you always such a bitch? It's just a little favor. No, you're demanding me to do it. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna mess up the poor woman's home. You can do it yourself, bitch. Fine. Yeah, fine. Exactly. I'm pretty sure that was a pair of boots there when we came in. Let's get to the point. Walter took a tape to the studio, but it wasn't the original one, was it? Oh, maybe we don't remember what's going on, but maybe Juliana remember what just happened, that she wants to go quickly through it. I'm not gonna s explain why she's doing or being a bitch, but who's like it? The original is here with you. How do you know that? We examined the one he had with him. I want, I want to see the original. She knows. Well, yes, I have it here. Do you know where he found this tape? It's this why you came here. Had I known, I wouldn't have opened the door. Here, take it. I don't want to see this thing. I will go have a smoke outside. Same as before. 
Tell me when you're done. I think I think Juliana knows what's going on. And we're not shooting anything. We don't have a lot of time and made her uncomfortable. Let me check the tape. Maybe there's something we can add to the video in the editing. Meanwhile, go talk to her, interview the widow. You always want to conduct an interview, right? We can make some time that way. See if she's up to answering some questions about the origin of this tape. Okay. She's gonna be fucked up. There she is. Deep breaths. Here we go. What's that smell? It's not a cigarette. <laughs> it's something else. No, focus. If I do a good job, I might get a new opportunity. I can help Miss Martha do a little better. I'm. Oh, he's a cameraman and wants to have opportunities for sure. Let's play the reporter. Miss Martins? What is it? You're done. Not yet. Junior's watching the tape. Meanwhile, I wanted to ask you some questions. For your program? Yes, for my program. Shouldn't the girl be asking the questions? Yeah, but she's busy with the tape. Of course, I'll waste the tape. Fine. Why always the tape? Why does she say always the tape? Fine, let's do this interview of yours. You better think ca carefully about these questions of yours. My head's about to burst. Now, she doesn't know, so we don't, don't need to question that. How was Walter on the tape? Normal, just like any other day. He spent so much time watching that thing, but his behavior was the same. He was uneasy, but never thought it would come down to this. I'm not sure you, ha you have seen it, but he left a note. I only noticed minutes after it had already happened. The only strange thing that day was that he made a copy of that tape. Do you know where the cape uh, came from? No, we need to investigate this. I think he's got it at home, but I didn't see who delivered it. Walter collected movies, hard to find film, recordings. I thought it was just another one. Just thinking about that girl alone in my living room, watching that thing, makes my skin crawl. Say, why is she interested in that tape? I would not, uh, to tell the truth maybe? Of course, the copy ended up being a blank, right? Or it got burned, I'm not sure. I can see how this would entice you, it's a mystery after all. But, how do you know? Don't you think that colleagues of yours is acting a little strange? Yeah, we said that already, man. What the heck is going on? I, I could swear I've seen her before. To be honest, I have a feeling I've seen you before as well. Maybe I've seen her at the studio, I'm not sure. I don't think so. I haven't been working there for... Hmm. Maybe that's why you don't seem to be like her. Not yet. Anyway. What? Me? Yes. Why are you in this anyway? Well, I fucked that interview. I'm, I'm curious why she knows so much. So you choose to omit yourself, right? No. I shouldn't blame you. You're not the fault. Not really. You know, I get it. I get the idea of moving up the ladder, the allure, the allure of a sensationalist piece of news. You can see it too, can't you? Nothing good came from this tape, from this whole thing. That's precisely why we need to investigate this. Do we really need to? Yes, we need to. Is it really the search for truth that's motivating the story you're working on? Or is it something else? I, I, I want to know now, yeah. At least you're being honest. Look, I've got a splitting headache. Go check if she's done, then leave, please. I want my living room back. Thank for your interview, Mrs. Yes, yeah, she more interviewed more us than we interviewed her. Why is it so bright? Wait, what did she do? That sounded like a gunshot. There we go again. There we go, go, go again. Oh, the TV is breaking down as well. 
Yeah, I need to reach the apartment. Yeah, the apartment. Which apartment? Detroit. Yes, that was it. What? He... Yes, that was it. What is happening? I had someone else with me. Juliana, yeah? Julie, Julie, Juliana. That's right. <laughs> we don't forget. Of course not. We're not in the game. The bitch. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, he's actually confirming what we have been saying the whole time. That tape that ruined us. What I saw in it. I watched an unrecorded nightmare. Let's go with that one. And it was not recorded. Can I ever wake awake from it? The apartment. She stayed there. The heck? Hello? Everything can be used. Oh no. I need to go on. Is this the right way? Ah, oh, fuck it. Go this way. Weird smell here. Where did I, sm I smell this before? Oh, there we go. There we go. This smell. Follow the smell. We're gonna go. To We're gonna die. We're gonna die. Yes! Yes! Is this the apartment? The smells coming from inside the apartment. Sulfur, maybe? Demonic presence? Oh, I know what it is. The smell. It's ozone. Looking through the smell. Yeah, of course we're gonna go in there. We wanna see what's going on. Better to record everything. Everything can be used. This is really a good game. It's it's really triggering me. It's really awesome. We're gonna go. We're gonna do the same. Let's see what happens when we do the same. Is this apartment? The smells come from inside the apartment. Yeah, we know. It makes me nauseous. That's the dog. Keep going. Doggy! Is that you? Making the sound? What happened here? Why is the dog here? Where's your owner, hmm? Hey, gunpowder. Where's your owner? Come on, boy. Come on, boy. Am I imagining things or is this dog avoiding the apartment? He is. Oh, not now, not now. Come on, come on, come on. Ugh. Ay, 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 ay. Gunpowder! Attack! Come back here! He's got into him. Yeah, he saw us what's standing behind you, mate. He just dashed down the hall. Huh? Looks like he was laying on top of something. Inspect the note. I'm not gonna go after gunpowder. It's a note. I've had it and did what I shouldn't. Now I have an unending nightmare in my brain. In an endless loop. With no chance escape in what scares me the most is that not much worse than the life i left behind if anyone reads this don't leave gunpowder alone she she also ah these letters are giving me vertigo it is on the note though wait the dog where did he go to gunpowder i'm going inside I need to. We're gonna go is we're gonna keep go forward the problem. Towards the problem, I mean. Am I going inside really? Really? I will. Let's go, mate. Fuck off. Don't be such a pussy. Hey, I just noticed now. What did you notice? 
in this awful. Say it out loud. Camera the camera carries me, not the other way around. I can't even tell when this started. Perhaps a long time ago. Maybe when I submitted my application. Gunpowder? I'm going in. Oh, this is creepy. It's really eerie. Hello? What happened to the TV? Oh boy, the boy is laying there. Don't click on anything though, besides this room. There we go. Hey, I find it really creepy. that we've been looking at all the time. That's the dog. Walter Martins. Teleforum. Caros telespectadores, boa noite. Hoje nós teremos uma transmissão especial. We're going to see what happened. Possivelmente a minha última. E com ela trago um comunicado a fazer para todos vocês. Descobri algo nas últimas semanas que tem, tem me assombrado desde então. Palavras não serão o bastante para descrever o que descobri. Portanto, eu vou precisar mostrar. E talvez isso venha a assombrar vocês, assim como tem me assombrado. Mas a minha profissão, o meu trabalho, foi revelar a verdade durante todos esses anos. E se quisermos nos libertar, preciso que todos saibam disso que tenho mostrado. Por isso... Acho que todos sintonizem bem seus aparelhos. Não cruzem suas pernas, isso é importante. Mas fiquem confortáveis com a coluna reta. E observem com atenção. Ok, we don't get. Please show it. Oh. We have some unseen tapes, I can see. Okay. Two people have been reported missing. 18 has not been seen since fourth. We had a chance to speak with the mother. Do you personally believe that there is some sinister hiding in there? No, of course not. People love ghost stories, but in the end, they're just stories. Just stories. Just stories. Just stories. Just stories. Just stories. Okay. Alright, I think that's, that's it, ladies and gentlemen. This is really creepy, man. We missed a couple of episodes or a couple of views, it seems, but I don't really care. It depends on, I think, which um, which line you choose to proceed into the game. I think it has a connection to that. And I'm not gonna replay it because otherwise, for me, the eerie feeling and the creepy feeling and the creepy factor falls away. This has been uh, quite a. In my opinion, wild right? Um, yeah, it's um, as I said in the beginning, it's different, different than we used to play. We're mostly in control of the character and uh, searching for our own. But this was really based on you don't know what it is. It's a mystery. It's creepy. It, the the even the light setting in the house and on the camera. It, it was well made to give you the whole time an uneasy feeling. If you allow yourself to feel that, that like that, this game is actually pretty cool and pretty awesome. As I said in the beginning, it's different, and that's why I actually wanted to play it. But for now, ladies and gentlemen, let me know what you think of this game. Let me know what you thought of it. Let me know what's actually maybe on the tape or how it played out. Let's 
discuss it. Let's talk about it. You can also come uh, go into the link. Of the uh, there is a link in the description to my Discord. So we can go there and talk. And we have some fun about this. Then we can actually uh, share some ideas. What actually was on the tape. And why he did what he did. But for now, ladies and gentlemen. Let's hop to the next video. I think I might play another Urban Legend horror game. We will see. But for now, we're going to hop. And I will see you there. Before we're going to hop. Before you're going to hop. If you want to check out another scary horror game that I played, check this one out. It scared me shitless. And if you want to see what's other uh, other things on my channel, go here and you can subscribe there as well. But for now, we are going to our place, gentlemen. Bye-bye and I love you all. Bye.